Hello everyone, my name is Thi Thu Chen and today I want to present my uh, paper uh, namely, namely Pragmatism and Constructivism in Conducting Research about University Enterprise Collaboration in the Vietnamese Context so I call it UEC Now um, in this article I just want to discuss the choice of methodology I had when conducting the research about on uh, UEC uh, in Vietnam um, indeed, I am a constructivist. I strongly believe in the merit of focusing on specific context in which people live and work in order to understand and undercover belief, value and motivation that underlie each individual behavior. However, in this paper, I will discuss the change or the shift in my worldview from uh, constructivism, constructivist to pragmatism. So I will employ both qualitative and quantitative um, research methods. Um, just bring a, a little bit background um, uh, information. It's in Vietnam um, higher education, uh, where the Vietnamese higher education seems to fail to satisfy the mission of um, uh, providing the industry with um, qualified skilled workers. So my aim of this research is to investigate how graduate employability can be better enhanced in Vietnamese context. I have three research questions and with these research questions such as like what are the obstacles and how is the current situation of UEC in Vietnam, it seems to be hard for me to stick with my favorable research product or which is constructivist. Because I know that there's a lot of realities uh, as is out there and I want to capture as many of those realities as possible. So um, those uh, ideas bring me to uh, pragmatism um, uh, where um, they argue that there is impossibility of complete objectivity or complete subjectivity in conducting research. So they can combine both of these approaches. They also re reject the idea that researchers have to choose the position between a pair of extremes, either constructivism or positivist. Okay, so if I, uh, when I employ this um, program in conducting my research, it helped me to provide a more complex understanding of the problem that would otherwise not have been accessible by using only one uh, single approach, qualitative or quantitative. Uh, pragmatism also brings quantitative and qualitative 